Say we're looking at an arm bar from the guard. Okay. Uh, skipping to know, it's quite useful. Not a situation you want to find yourself in. Though it's more commonly associated with BJJ and MMA, as also happened with Sambo and obviously self defence. So, anytime I'm in this position, I want to be closing my guard up. But I've got short legs, I'm still able to close them on most people. If I can't, I'm just going to dig my heels in here. Okay, notice Sam's hands are posted on my chest. This means he wants me to break his elbow. Okay, anytime someone in this position, they're legally consenting to you breaking their elbows. So, you're going to secure one arm, shoot the other arm on their legs. This will create twists in your body, giving you a better angle. This foot's still digging in here. I'm going to bring this foot around, so that's right of his head. Extend my hips. Call them that to snap. Okay. Look at it again, a little bit more speed. Securing, going under, spin around. Okay, do we do that from the other angles or? In that side. I'll go that side. Okay. Just treat you people at home. <laughs> <laughs> so, you're going to secure one arm, shoot the other arm under their legs. This will create twists in your body, giving you a better angle. This foot's still digging in here. I'm going to bring this foot around so that's right of his head. Extend my hips, cause them that to snap. Okay, look at it again, a little bit more speed, securing, going under, spin around, pop. Okay, do it again. If it clicks, just hold it and I'll tap, it's fine. So, wait a second. Okay, so what we're going to look at is one of our Newer female students doing this on an aggressive male with a top knot. <laughs> okay, one more time. Good.